this tutorial, we'll learn how to download and install a theme from Drupal.org using the administrative user interface or by using Drush. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know how to download and install a theme from Drupal.org using either the UI provided by the Update Manager module or the Drush command line tool. Before you get started with this tutorial, you want to make sure that you know what themes are and how to find a theme that you want to install. If you want to install themes via the user interface, the core Update Manager module must be installed. And if you plan to use Drush, you'll need to make sure that you have Drush installed. See the written version of this tutorial for links to each of these prerequisite tutorials. You can use the administrative interface or Drush to install a contributed theme if you are installing a custom theme rather than a contributed theme, or if you see a message saying installing modules and themes requires FTP access to your server, or if for some reason the following steps don't work to download and unpack the theme files, follow the steps in the manual installation tutorial. If you're installing a contributed theme with external dependencies that are managed by Composer, follow the steps for downloading in the Using Composer tutorial. In either of these cases, then continue here with the instructions for using the administrative interface towards the end of the video. If you're using the user interface to install a theme, the first thing you need to do is navigate to the project page for the theme you want to install. For example, drupal.org slash project slash mayo. Then scroll to the download section at the bottom of the page. Right click on the tar.gz link and copy the URL. On your site, in the Manage Administrative menu, navigate to Appearance. Then click Install New Theme. In the field Install from a URL, paste the value of the URL that you copied from the, the theme's project page, and then click Install. This will download and unpack the theme files onto your server. Once that's complete, click Install Newly Added Themes. This will return you to the Appearance page. If you use the manual upload procedure, start with this step and reach the Appearance page by using the Manage Administrative menu and clicking on Appearance. Here, locate the newly added theme under Uninstalled Themes, and then click Install and Set as Default to use it. All non-administrative pages on the site will now use this default theme. Alternatively, you can use Drush to download and install a theme. Start by finding the project name for the theme you want to install, which is the last segment of the theme's project page URL. For example, if the project is drupal.org slash project slash mayo, M-A-Y-O, is the project name. I'll go ahead and copy that. Then, at the command line from the root directory of my site, I can run the drush command, drush dl mayo. Substitute mayo for the name of the theme that you're installing. Then, run the drush command Drush en Mayo. This will enable the newly added theme. Answer yes when prompted. And finally, run the command drush config set system.theme default Mayo to set the theme that you've just enabled as the default theme. Answer yes when prompted. And now Mayo should be our default theme. If for some reason you do not see the effect of these changes in your site, you might need to clear the cache. In this tutorial, we downloaded and installed a theme from Drupal.org using the Update Manager module and also using Drush.